Our next segment will make you laugh, make you cry, and lose 15 pounds. Yes, indeed. It is time for another journey into the mind of John Dabkovich, who needs his own page. For Wiggy. Wiggy who? Yeah, it will do all those things. It's adaptogenic. It <laughs> This is his new favorite term, adaptogen. Meets you where you are. Uh, yeah, it meets you where you are. You need to gain 15 pounds, we can help you with that. Lose 15, help you with that. Uh, if, you need, uh, if you don't know, guys, the game goes like this. Uh -huh. I give you three famous people who have something in common. Then I give you a semi-obscure factoid from their Wikipedia page, and you have to tell me which one it applies to. Not everybody, though, has a factoid chosen, so you cannot use the process of elimination. Today, we have for you three people celebrating a birthday today. Kelsey Grammer, Jordan Peele, and Jennifer Love Hewitt. Whoa. <clears throat> As always, if anybody goes three for three, you will get the relish currently being guarded by Tommy Lee Jones in our refrigerator. And we're also testing the relish. We'll explain. It's, uh, it moved my lunch. Okay. It's in there. Yeah, that's the lunch. Move that. And then uh, the flan cake. <laughs> The flaunt move that there we go and hey, then it looks be careful like, that cake it's still good oh that's also my cheese okay. uh, and then the kombucha yeah uh, and then once you get the kombucha out and then it's there there have been some uh, questions about um, the palatability of this yes relish. we have a nobody an, wants to taste it but we have a new high-tech device an electromagnetic yeah, device Tom you want to get in there and hit hit it with that and see uh, <laughs> engineer yeah. Tom yeah. Checking probably needs to open, take the top off. Yeah. I don't know if we want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> is it radioactive? Well, the good news is it's only slightly radioactive. Okay. Oh, okay. okay. All right. All right. Here okay. we go. As I mentioned earlier, guys, uh, this is the darkest edition of, oh. of WikiWho yet. It's oh, the oh. second question that's going to get dark. Okay. And then we're going to finish with a laugh. Okay. Uh, here we go. Damn. Question number one. Who toured the Soviet Union as part of a dance company? As part of a dance company? Dance yeah. Company. Dancer. I'm going to say Kelsey Grammer. You know what? I want it to be Kelsey Grammer. Yeah. Yeah. Tracy, what do you think? Jordan Peele. All right. I can just picture Kelsey Grammer with his voice. Dos Vidanya. <laughs> <laughs> oh. uh, so Jordan Peele, guys, is multi-talented. Yes. Yeah. Multi-talented. He can act. Mm -hmm. He can direct. Mm -hmm. He can write. Yeah. Don't know if he can dance. <laughs> but you know who else is multi-talented in that group? Kelsey Grammer. He went to Juilliard. Yes, he did. He looks like he went to Juilliard. I know, right? It was the 1988 Texas show team that toured the Soviet Union, though, with a nine-year-old Jennifer Love Hewitt. What? Yeah, I guess she did tap and ballet or whatever. Huh. Apparently, a team from Texas went went to the Soviet Union. Okay. okay. I'm just picturing people like in St. Petersburg being like, hey, let's go watch those little girls from Texas dance. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Where? Uh, okay, think? here's the one that gets dark. Uh, whose father was killed in a racially motivated attack? Okay, so I feel like low-hanging fruit, it can't be Jordan Peele because that would be too obvious, right? I don't know that movie. Or is it so obvious? Mm. That it's hiding in plain sight. Because Get Out had me feeling a whole different type of way. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know, I'm going to go with Kelsey Grammer. Me too. Yeah. I'm going to go low hanging fruit. I'll go Jordan Peele. Okay. Okay, guys. Well, Jennifer Love Hewitt's dad was a medical technician. And I think we all can agree nobody likes them. <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> I'm kidding. I just, no. uh, that's the only fact I knew about her dad was that he was a medical technician. Um, Jordan Peele was raised by his mother after the age of seven. Mm. So the story goes like this. It's the editor of the Virgin Islands View a newspaper mm -hmm. shot and killed outside his home, which was just the first tragedy to befall Kelsey Grammer's family. Oh. Mm -hmm. So apparently this was after um, uh, um, Martin Luther King had been assassinated mm -hmm. and there had been some, I guess, retaliation would be yeah. the other word. Yeah. And that's when he was he was killed there. But let's see what else has happened to his family. Kelsey Grammer's sister was kidnapped and murdered. Whoa. Oh my gosh. His two brothers died in a scuba diving accident. Oh. Ooh. And so he, uh, he, uh, you know, he's had issues with substance abuse over the years and stuff. Mm -hmm. And it's like you can kind of see how, how that would happen yeah. with that much trauma in your life. So anyway, I told you guys that was the darkest. Whoa. Wow. That yeah, is the. Dar I mean, yeah. I didn't know that about his life, and it's like, gosh, that's a lot. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. Let's end on something. And also underscores the fact that racially motivated attacks can go 
Either different way. Yes, yes. Um, and it was... For yeah. anybody following along at home. Yes, that is a good... That is a good point, yes. Okay, uh, let's finish on something a bit lighter, let's shall do. we? Let's uh, do. Uh, who majored in puppetry? <laughs> Jordan Peele. Wouldn't that be great? That would be great. Do you, do you think he's working on a movie right now that features oh, puppets? That would be amazing. I'm going to say Jordan Peele because oh, I want that to happen. I want a scary okay. puppet movie. I'm going to go Jennifer Love. Hewitt. Well, guys, Jennifer Love Hewitt was a star at a young age. She was on, what, Party of Five? Party of oh, Five, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So I don't know that she went to college. Mm. If she did, uh, then maybe she, maybe she did major in puppetry, and then my question's wrong. But it doesn't <laughs> say anything in her Wikipedia. <laughs> I mentioned that Kelsey Grammer went to Juilliard. Yes. Which offers a number of programs. True. Dance, music, drama. And within drama, you have other subcategories, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. But not puppetry like Sarah Lawrence College has, where Jordan Peele got his degree hey, in, in puppetry. Yeah. We got